It's hard not to see inflation's effects. The grocery store and gas pump are a couple of prime examples, but it's even affecting a fall staple. Nicole Delgado spent part of the day at a local pumpkin patch. Nicole? That's right, Eric. The owner of Time and Again Farm tells me she knows the last couple of years have been tough, but she prides herself on being able to keep her low prices. Just full of squash and full of apples and pumpkins, and we've taken some gigantic squash home in the past and really, really enjoy it. It's, it's a lot of fun. Time and Again Farm is 12 acres of pumpkin, squash, gourds, and apples in Winnebago County. David Kopp and his wife drove in from Chicago to pick up their favorite fall staples. Very happy to be here and uh, just enjoying the, the, the beautiful weather and all the squash. And I think we're taking, I think we bought about $70 worth of squash and honey. Owner Susan Kramer says it's been a good year, despite all of the rain earlier this month. We would have waited a week. We would have been swimming <laughs> in the mud. Um, so we were very grateful um, that we harvested when we did. But it was a good growing year, even though there was a bit of a drought at the beginning of the summer. Um, it didn't really affect us. Susan tells me the farm started out as just a hobby that's now turned into a thriving business. My hopes are that people will um, come out and learn um, about squash and pumpkins and apples, um, applesauce, apple butter, learn how to. Um, feed their family and provide for their family at a reasonable price. This is David's third visit, and he plans on coming back. Really nice to have the good good weather and seeing all these nice things that they've done. Go home and enjoy the delicious squash because we'll be eating these for the next couple months. The time and again farm is open seven days a week from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Eric, thanks, Nikel.